Now let's take a closer look inside the biosend filter to understand how it works. The bio layer is at the top of the sand in the biosand filter where many microorganisms live. You can't see them because they are too small. As you keep using the biosand filter, more and more of the microorganisms gather in the bio layer. This is good. The biosand filter needs lots of microorganisms to work properly. But some microorganisms, called pathogens, are dangerous and make us sick. The biosand filter's main job is to remove these pathogens from the water. This happens in the bio layer and the sand in different ways. One way is in the bio layer where microorganisms eat each other. This is how some of the pathogens in the water are killed. When you first set up the biosand filter, there aren't any microorganisms living in the bio layer, so not as many pathogens are killed. But after 30 days, the bio layer is fully grown and lots of microorganisms are eating up lots of pathogens. That's the time when the bio layer is really effective. Another way the biosand filter removes pathogens is in the deep sand. Some pathogens get trapped between the tiny grains of sand or they get stuck to the sand. Most of the remaining pathogens die. So now you should understand how the bio layer and the sand remove pathogens from the water.